Hi everyone! In this video, I'm going to share with you my top three Qigong exercises that I like to include in many of my routines. These exercises are easy to learn and do. They're great for mornings or midday breaks. They're also good if you need something quick to recharge and refresh. And if you're just starting out with Qigong, these are the ones to do. Let's begin. Begin in a standing position. Keep your feet flat on the ground and parallel to each other. Soften your knees and drop your tailbone down right between your heels. Lengthen through your spine and keep your whole body nice and relaxed. The first exercise is called twist and turn. You know, if you follow my channel, you might notice that I do this a lot. But today we're going to bring our attention and knock on the lower abdomen and the lower back. So make your hands into loose fists and gently knock across your abdomen and the lower back. Keep your knees comfortably bent as you turn. Keep your lower back nice and relaxed. This exercise is great for bringing more energy into the body, activating the vital acupressure points located on our back and the abdomen. Good for digestion. Also, you can control your pace if you want to slow down. That's totally okay. You can do this exercise a bit slower, just focusing on the points and the alignment of the body. There's also a great whole body warm up. So if you only have a couple of minutes, you need to quickly recharge your batteries, get energized. This one a good one to do. Okay, very good. Slow down, unwind, and take a few seconds here. Maybe move your arms to the side. Notice how your body feels. Already the body is responding with the sensations to the movement. This is very good. Movement number two is the variation of lifting the sky with both hands. And this one is really good because it covers, lets us open the chest and lets us stretch the entire spinal column. So this is very good. So keep your feet parallel, same position. And first, raise your hands through the side. Open yourself like a sea star reaching through your fingers, through the crown of the head, and rooting down through your feet. Open your whole body, open your chest. Then soften, turn your palms up, go up. Bend the wrists and focus on the center line of your body, lengthen through the spine. Maybe tuck your chin to the chest, open and lengthen through the back of the neck and come up all the way to the center of your palms. Hold, 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 then release, relax your shoulders, relax your elbows, soften your wrists and let this wave of relaxation just flow down your body, all the way down to your feet. Pay attention to all the sensations inside. Then we go again. Open first. Reach up in both directions. Then release. Go up. Turn. Stay on the ground by lengthening, extending your spine beyond your body reach up. If you can't quite reach this way, it's okay to keep your hands just 
in a position that feels good for you. Focusing on effortless elongation rather than straining or pulling. Then soften, let the whole body relax. Soft and soft and soft and relax. We go again, one more time. Open. Stretch out through the fingers. Feel that tension opening the chest. Then soften, turn the palms up. Go up. Bend the wrists, press out gently. Lengthening the whole body upward. Then release, soften. And you can feel a wave of relaxation just goes down. The body, the sides of the body, into your legs, all the way down to your feet. Take a moment here to observe the sensations inside. Feel the fingers and the inside of your arm, down your back. Lots of awareness and space. Very good. And the movement number three is that touch the sky and press the earth. You also see me doing that a lot. It's a fantastic exercise. If you have back problems or kidney problems, it's also good for stretching the hamstrings. So we're gonna raise the hands through the side, take a nice deep breath in, then exhale down through the center line, bring your breath all the way to your belly. Place your hands on the lower abdomen, slide back on the kidneys. Take a second here to notice the warmth of your hands. They're like heating pads. Feel that warmth going in. Then gently arch your back. Open your chest to the sky. Look up. Release. And bend forward from your hips. Keeping your back fairly straight. Slide down. If you can go all the way down, that's very good. If you want to stop at your knees, that's fantastic as well. Here you want to lengthen through the lower back. Then slide to the front. And a nice deep inhale, raise up. Exhale, let it feel your lower abdomen. It's like completing the circle. So we're going to inhale again. Exhale down. Inhale, slide back. Exhale, open the chest to the sky. Inhale, lean forward. Exhale, go down. Inhale, raise up. Exhale, bring your awareness to the lower belly. Inhale, go up. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Every time you may go a little lower, but no pressure here. Just keep it gentle, lengthening through the back. Inhale, raise up. Exhale, soften. And last one here, go up. Exhale, bringing your breath and awareness to the lower abdomen. Inhale, slide to the back. 
exhale inhale release and exhale down inhale raise up feel that power in your breath and then exhale let it all sink into the belly very common and centering when we use our intention and the breath and the movement the three factors combining into one is a very powerful self-healing tool very good relax your hands by the side and if you feel like you need to move around a little bit that's totally okay you can maybe even shake over your legs to the side loosen up but otherwise just take a moment here again to quickly do a mental check for all of your body how you feel notice there is less going on here and more here present focused and just a general sense of awareness and kind of fullness from the inside out Thank you very much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it. So you can practice it every day if you want to or add it to your current Qigong routine. And uh, as usual, don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this. Click the subscribe button below this video and I'll see you soon.